But it is so true that if the person, you decide not to be with them, and if the reaction is negative, it's almost a win-win situation. Yeah. You get what I mean? Absolutely. If someone acts not in a very nice way, when you tell them you don't want to be with them, did you really want to be with them to begin with? Because that's bad character that you're seeing in that person. That's true. And like, that, that exists in them. And that you didn't spend one day further moving in that direction that yes. you're seeing now. And that is the saving grace yeah. for sure. Yeah. And I, I really do. I have to tell you, obviously a part of our lives are on social media and right. in the public. And you, Real Sam, everybody out there who really knows who I am and what we're about and just, you know me and I love you for that. Thank you for holding it down. Thank you for yeah. just being positive through this all, you know? We're gonna get um, through it. Yeah. And, you know, we are here for you, you know? Always. Um, when we say, like, just to answer the question, you know, um, I always, I look back at some of my relationships and really? wonder, why didn't I get out of it sooner? Really? Why would I still, you know, because I was afraid I would. And then I finally realized there are other fish in the sea. You just got to keep fishing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, yeah. it's like, I was like, you know, because I've been getting, I mean, you could do everything for them, yeah. financially, sexually, you know, whatever. You know, you be there emotionally. And it's just, sometimes you just have to take a beat back and so, if, to answer the question, why didn't I do it sooner, or what would I, I would say most of my relationships. Really? You know? Really? Most of no my way, relationships. Lonnie. Yeah, definitely. I thought I was the only one who thought that. I no, felt like it's a school. million of us out here who had a relationship. Yeah, it's pretty oh, sure. It's like, girl, but at the time, the, the D was good. Or the, oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't no, know. He had some money. And you we know, make excuses. You know. As women, we make excuses so just many. because we but think I'm that... But I'm saying that because I don't want you to feel like you're being foolish. You're, you're, you're not, not being a fool all. at all, girl. At you all. are making progress, and we keep on moving. Yes. That's what we yeah, got to do. At all. Okay. What about you, yes. Adrian? I had a list of really dumb things now that I'm looking at it, but, <laughs> <laughs> like... Well, okay, I wrote that I, I, I wish that I knew that love the way it is for me now existed. Oh, but wow. now even hearing you talk, I'm like, I wish I knew back when I said yes to my first engagement that the ring wasn't going to make me feel like what I had gone through m made me feel like I won. Ah, oh, I get what you're saying. I, yeah. I, I don't get it. <laughs> when you've been in a relationship with somebody for a long time and... I've spoken about it, like yeah. I wasn't like paraded on social media or like I didn't get the love or the attention or the affection that I thought I deserved. Even though by that time, we both knew it was over, I felt like the ring made me feel like what I had, the years I put into it, oh. at least I had something to show for it. Okay. I got asked okay. and that was enough for me. Do you know you what I mean? You felt like yeah. that ring was, a, was enough to blanket everything, the, all the other havoc that yeah. you had been through. That like, you were but, at, but at least he, he wanted to marry me. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Do you get what I mean? I like, know it. Yes. Some people yeah. will ask, well then why did you say yes? And if I'm honest, I had a girlfriend at the time that told me, just say yes and think about it later. Wow. I wow. probably should not Ooh. have taken that advice. Yeah. Um, but I thought, well, I deserve this. Yeah. Like in that moment, like I, I deserve to be able to say, well, I well, earned I, this after what I yeah, went through. Yeah, I don't get, now looking back, I think that's so bizarre how again, we do make excuses yes. of like, what's okay, what's not okay. Well, at least if I'm getting played, but I got a ring. Like, wait, what? Like, wh right. And I think a lot of people don't know that I actually went to Paris very intentionally because I knew I was so unhappy and I didn't know what I was going to do or how I was going to deal with what I wanted to move forward in my life doing. Uh -huh. And I sat in Paris by my damn self. I didn't want to hear other people's voices. Sometimes you just got to escape and silence the yes. other voices. I don't want to hear what my family has to say. Yep. I don't want to hear what he had to say. You have to literally get out of the country Yo, sometimes. That's, I left the why country. Why do you think I spent all <laughs> summer in Europe? That's yes. so true. And you, you, I literally was by myself in a country I had never really spent time in. I didn't even speak the language. I would get on the train every day by myself with my little Metro Pass in Paris. And I would cry on the train listening to worship me like, God, just guide me, like, tell me what I'm supposed to do because yeah. I knew I had made the wrong decision. It's the weirdest thing, but sometimes you find yourself when you get lost. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. If I knew then what I know now.